Lucy Buttons. Lucy Buttons? Yeah. Here you go. The Lucy Buttons. Okay, so Lucy Buttons, what are you famous for? Burlesque. Burlesque? That's awesome. So how long have you been doing burlesque? Eight years. How about you, sir? What do you do? I'm Helvis. Helvis? That is awesome. So when did you become Helvis? What? Um, actually, 2004. Exactly what are you and what inspired your costume? Uh, I was really inspired by like space princesses and basically just uh, like never ending story stuff. But I'm in Mermaid. Oh, never ending story is such a great movie. Yeah, I love that movie. Okay, so I love the makeup. How long did that take? Really quick, actually. Really? I just like was in the run and rush trying to get out. I had to get my hair braided at Nene Salon this morning. So. Oh, nice. And uh, so this is just shoulder pads, or what? How did you make those, or did you buy them? A football uh, thing that I had in high school actually, and then I just converted it into Dude, this. That's what set it off. Like I like the whole thing. All right. So what's your name? Mike. Tell me about your costume. Uh, what did you dress up as? As a sea urchin. Oh, a sea urchin. Cool. And what inspired you to do that? Sex. Sex. So sea urchins are sexy? Prickly. Prickly. Oh, are you into that? Yeah. All right, I like that. Come on over and get into this too. Uh, oh, so that's that's what he's been saying all day. People just have to touch it. No touching, just kiss the tip. Oh, just a tip. All right, so uh, obviously, it is the biggest lie I ever told. So did you do like? Did you put this all together yourself, or did you have help? Uh, I did the costume that I'm wearing, and a good friend of mine is a really great makeup artist. He did all the paint. So how long did it take you to get painted up? It took us four hours. Four hours. So you had to get up at like 6 this morning? We started at 6.30. We finished around 10.30. to take you to plan your costume? Uh, a, month. a month. A month? Yeah, but they were made within like the past 24 hours. Okay. Yeah. Who made them? Uh, we did, actually. Yeah. We sold them on. Yeah. Okay. We got the shells yesterday morning. <laughs> so, like, did those come, like, at Michael's, or what did you do to get, uh... Amazon. <laughs> Amazon. We just yeah. got the beads, and yeah. we started sewing yeah. them on. So, Amazon, I'm a Prime member, so, you know, cut me a check for this. Amazon Prime seashells for Tatas. Yeah. Um, that, that's, that hashtag will be trending by tonight, seashells for Tatas. If you could give, like, one piece of, like, life advice from Mermaid Parade, what would it be? Uh, always wear less. <laughs> I like that. I like that. We can be friends after this. Follow me on YouTube. Live your life. Just have fun. I like that. Free. Just enjoy your life. So, uh, you from around here? You from around here? <laughs> What originally made you come up with the costume idea that you have today? You know, I thought the Mermaid Parade was over. And then someone said it's tomorrow. So with a small budget, a nice package, and a positive attitude, you can do anything. Can you put that on a t-shirt? With a small budget, what would you say? A small bucket, a big package, and uh, say it one more time for you. Positive cause. attitude. So small budget, <laughs> big package, positive attitude. You, you can, can do win. whatever you want in life. Anything. How many, you, how many years you said that you've done this I've total? I've done this 20 years. 20 years? Um, are, you, are you the same thing every year or a new costume? It can't be the same thing every year, brother. Come on. We've done every ocean, every sea, every culture you can imagine. What have we not done? I don't know. We'll figure it out. Have you ever done a Bollywood theme? Because I would pay to see that. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea, though. Actually, I was talking to my niece oh, about that. Here, about let that. me give you... Indian Ocean. Many times. You know what? Second place you deserve first. Yeah, we do a lot. We get a lot of first place. Yeah, yes. we do. Kill everyone. I'm hi. How are you? This is our drag queen Indian of the day. I know. Oh, the drag queen Indian. Did you have a name, drag queen Indian? Like, did you come up with an Indian name? I, I call myself uh, Jano uh, Queen Santo. Jano <laughs> Queen Santo. I would call myself Pocahine if I was a drag queen. Oh, I've had Pocahine. Oh,
What is your favorite thing about the Mermaid Parade? I just like how you can just like do whatever you want and everyone's just down to party, you know? I'm into the exposed nipples. Ah, I do like that. I'm really into the exposed nipples. I'm just into like everyone just being themselves because like everyone's really a mermaid at heart. And now everyone has the opportunity to really express themselves as human beings. It's all about like but mostly as mermaids. <laughs> It's, it's also like uh, uh, merman. Yeah, mer I'm a merman. No. I know I said that like 17 times. I love that movie. I'm like I'm a merman, Dad. Merman. That's a Zoolander reference for anybody that's under age 20. For the kids at home. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it's okay. It's okay. I'm fine. <laughs> he he went out that microphone like, hey, I was like, I got something to say. Cool. What were you going to say? I was just going to say that for all y'all who don't know about the Mermaid Parade, come here for 2015 because you already missed out on 2014.